Bandit land will be rocking tomorrow night. The Buffalo Bandits are back in the National Lacrosse League finals and Bree Eldridge uh, spoke with a couple of the stars who tell us the start of the season didn't go exactly according to plan. The Buffalo Bandits getting ready to face Colorado in game one, a familiar opponent at a familiar site, but the Bandits say a lot has changed. I think we're a lot different this year than last year. I think last year we were projected to be the best team to play. This year I feel like a lot of uh, people thought we were going to be kind of mid-pack and we kind of proved people wrong. Somehow Dane Smith. There's no doubt that the Bandits exceeded expectations, but it didn't come without growing pains. We started off a little slow. We lost to um, Albany in the first game of the year, and I think that was a, a wake-up call for us. Buffalo went on to win 14 of their next 17 regular season games. There's been so much that this team has had to deal with. Um, you know, one goal games, super close games. So I, I think we're just a lot more resilient. Now into the postseason, the Bandits offense kicked it up a notch. The offense has dominated, winning by nine goals or more, courtesy of Dane Smith and Josh Byrne leading on the scoreboards. We have some incredible teammates, guys that don't really get a lot of credit. Um, but they're doing a lot of the dirty work to, you know, open up myself and Dean. And if the two top scoring leaders go cold momentarily, this offense is loaded enough to rely on someone else to step up. Um, every night it could be someone different going off. It's the right momentum and the right time to try to bring home the championship trophy, something they haven't been able to do since 2008. I'm 30 years old. I've been in this league for uh, 10 plus years, and it, it just goes to show you I've been to three finals now, haven't had anything to show from it. With the blend of the vets and the rookies, the team is entering Saturday on one accord. No matter what happens, you're, you're always going to do your best to, to try and um, succeed. So I think that's a testament to this team. and. Um, we're never going to quit on anything. And the next test just happens to be in an anticipated sold out bandit land. Brianna Aldridge, 7 Sports, Buffalo.